What's up YouTube fam, Swaggy T here giving you guys another video for today. Um, I actually just picked these up probably the same week I picked up my AE1 Lowe's. So, I was just like, I'm doing too much. <laughs> so, I'm going to chill after these for a while until I see something that I really want to get. But, I had to pick these up because I missed the other colorway and I wasn't going to pay... Um, resale for what they were going for it was damn near 300 for my size so i was like i don't think the shoe is worth 300 in my opinion so i i picked up this colorway um i'm happy to have these first and foremost the shoe i don't know why nike released them in just you know women's sizes but they did release um uh sizes that you know men could cop as well so Hopefully you guys know your women's size if you want to cop these. I'm a size 10 and a half, so I had to get a women's 12. So you do the math or you just, you know, go online and see the size chart, or whatever you need to do. But women's 12, men's 10 and a half is what I had to get. So um, the colorway that I got is the Vault Black and White colorway. So let's go ahead and look at these bad boys. Yes, sir. Ski. Go ahead and take them out. Right. Oh. oh shit! So this review is just gonna be pretty much straightforward. Um, the box is just an old box from um, I believe 1999 that um, they were, were releasing the same shoe in. So it's the same box, same box. I don't know if y'all want me to read this, but it's engineered and built to the exact specifications of championship athletes from around the world. So that's what the box says. Let's go ahead and get into the shoe. One of the shoes fell, I gotta pick them up real quick. All right, so we have the Nike Sonder Air Max in that bolt and black colorway. Y'all see them, y'all see them, y'all see them. Hey, I ain't gonna lie, this colorway is actually dope. Like. This colorway and the highlighter pink, uh, white and black dropped as well. So I had to go with the Volt. Uh, <laughs> I had a pair of Volt shoes before. Um, they were the uh, Air Max pennies. I think I think they were the fives. I had those, but um, I had sold them because I don't know. I really don't even know why I sold them. To be honest, oh, I know why I sold them because I had got a size ten when I should have got a size ten and a half. They was just so snug, man. Like, I, I couldn't do it. So, and they were just sitting. So, I just had to do away with them. But, anyways, so here we have it the Nike Sonder Air Max. You see them? I don't know why. These kind of remind me of like a taxi or some shit. I don't know. The shoe is wrapped in nylon. But you have this rubber zip tie right here. That you can zip it up so me personally i don't think i'm gonna really like tie these up i'm gonna just zip it up <laughs> and be on my way but on the inside right here you have that six four two three is that no six four five three my bad i can't see damn i'm slow six four five three so that six four five three from what i saw and read this is um nike a number that you can call the last four digits for the nike offices and you know punch it in it spells out nike pretty much please go true to size on these i know i saw a couple people on youtube that did videos of the previous colorway the colorway that dropped before i saw a lot of people saying that the shoe is very snug but in my opinion it's not snug at all so just go true to size um the only thing I will say though that will make it snug is if you actually are tying the shoe like on the inside and then zipping that bit up, of course it's gonna be snug. It's gonna be snug, it's gonna feel tight. So I put these on, I tried them on um, earlier before I started filming. Didn't tie them up or nothing. I just zipped them up. Fit good to me. So <laughs> you can go either way. You can. You can wear it unzipped or you can wear it zipped up. So me personally, I might switch it up. I might go some days unzipped and then some days if I'm just in a hurry, I'm gonna zip that bit up real quick and be on my lovely way. You have that and then you have the inner lining in here with the 
pull tab as well with that Volt Nike right there. Now on the inside, it almost feels like some like a microfiber cloth or something. So I guess that just helps to kind of you know slide your foot in. So that's nice. Then you got the Nike Air Focus. Focus. You got the Nike Air on the inside right there. The swoosh in the air logo. And on the mid guards, you have like this reflective dominoes looking situation. So you have that right there on the out and inner mid guard right there. And then I like this. This is a nice touch right here. So that Nike bubble air unit, you can see some Volt, some of that Volt color is in there. And then on the pull tab on the back, you have that swoosh and air as well. And on the back, this is like some, some sort of new book, some sort of new book right here. I don't know if y'all can see that. Some sort of new book right here on the booty, the heel. Then on the back, I mean, on not on the back, on the bottom of the shoe, you have this crazy design. I don't even know like what to call this. It's focusing on my eyes. I don't even know what to call this, but it's dope. And then you got the Nike, let me flip it over. You got the Nike, uh, y'all can see it. The Nike Air Max logo right there. You don't wanna focus. There you go. You got it right there. So yeah, that's pretty much to show you guys like, I ain't gonna lie, the materials on the shoe, there's nothing premium. I hope that's not what y'all was looking for because they're just re-releasing these. And I think um, the next pair of these that will be dropping, I don't know when they'll be dropping, but I wanna say it's the Gore-Tex. Um, the Gore-Tex collab with these, so that'll probably be like more premium if you want to try to wait and cop those. I think that'll be like an all black colorway and then it's another colorway that they'll be doing with the Gore-Tex, but I really just wanted to have a pair in my collection already. I, could, I, could, I, I couldn't wait that long, man. And like I said, I wasn't paying resale for the first colorway that Nike had dropped, so I was like, I'll just settle for these and get these, man. I can pull these off and, you know, I needed the Volt colorway in my collection again, so um, this is uh, this is not a long drawn out video, or nothing. It's straight to the point, straight to the materials of the shoe, and that's pretty much it, you guys. So I'm happy to have these in my collection. Uh, I'm gonna give you guys the on feet as always, but if you enjoyed this video, make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button for your boy hit that like button for your boy it helps my videos a lot and you guys been showing out as a recent and uh shouts out to all the new subscribers that are tuning in because you know i, I can see y'all showing love and i just want to show love back into the people that been subscribed i'm forever forever grateful continue supporting me i appreciate it and um yeah let's go ahead and get into the on feet uh swaggy t i'm out man peace Hey, man, that shit is